so if you follow me on social media, you've probably already seen this picture, and I'm going to tell you all the details about it in this video. So I'm wearing two bundles of 20 inches of the Hope Kinks collection from Hope Kinky Hair. You should follow them on social media. And I'm wearing this hair in preparation of a summer protective styling brunch, which is an event that I'm doing in conjunction with Hope Kinky Hair as part of their brunch tour across the country. So they sent me this hair to install for the event, and here's a before picture of the hair. It's colored. I will make a separate video about the hair color that I did for it. I used a Shea Moisture box color, but I'm going to talk about that more in another video. And my hair was installed by African Creature, or Hair by Susie, and she's an awesome hairstylist located in Queens, New York, and she's going to be at the event too. And Susie hooked me up with a partial weave install, so she just braided up the middle and left out hair in the back and the sides, and then in the front for a flexible part, but I like a side part, so she did it more towards one side. And here's the final result. I had to take a selfie. So in the rest of this video, I'm going to be showing you how I can achieve that big hair at home with this Hope Kinky hair. So I put my hair into about eight braids, and I braided up the sides of the back of my hair separately from the weave, but the front of my hair is braided in, with it, in the weave. And I'm just quickly putting some oil on the hair. And I only used water to do the braids. I didn't want a lot of definition, so I didn't use any product, but it still holds a curl really well. And I'm just going to kind of separate and fluff, and I'm starting with my own hair, and I'm going to move on to doing that with the Hope Kinky hair. And if I came across any tangles, um, I just kind of worked through them. It's very similar to my own hair, so whatever I would do with my hair, I do with this hair. And I'm just showing you how well it blends on the side here. In this clip, I just wanted to show you how it looks when I unbraid this section that has both my hair and the Hope Kinky hair and I braided them together so that it would blend a little bit better. Um, I didn't want my hair to have one braid pattern and then the Hope Kinky hair have another braid pattern at the top so just going through and you just separate for the gods man. Just keep on separating, separating fluff and that's my hair right there, that little piece up there. And I'm just continuing to separate, fun fun fun. It, this took me a long time. It was a long process, like 30 minutes. <laughs> but this is the same thing that I would do if I wanted big hair. I would, and this is what I did do when my hair was blown out. I just put it in some braids and then separated and fluffed until it was super big. So the same process works on this hair. And you can pretty much do whatever you want to do to your own natural hair to this hair. So now that I'm done taking down all my sections, I'm just kind of raking my fingers through to further blend my hair with the Hope Kinky hair. And I don't know if you can tell where my hair stops and the weave begins, but I will say that this hair fooled quite a many natural. I went to two hair events on this day, and a lot of people were like, oh my gosh, how'd you grow your hair so long? And I was like, oh my gosh, it's a weave, but thank you. <laughs> um, so that's the, how the top looks. So it's a really seamless blend, and me coloring it to match my hair made it look even a lot more like my own hair. And again, a video, the next video I post will be about that. So there are a little bit of... Um, the ends are a little bit straggly, so I'm just going to go through with the scissors and trim the ends a little bit here and there. Susie, after she installed my hair, did give me a little trim in the front where my part is to give a little bit more shape to the hair. But that's it. I love it. I'm about to make my little cute face. <laughs> so thank you guys for watching. I'll see you later.